I'm going to start here. That's going to be your in and out cross. Left hand. So there's your in and out cross. Here's our drive. On this drive, I want to throw this thing behind. So one bounce, throw it straight behind. So, yep. So, so, no, not, not a wrap, just like a straight behind. So I'm just here. Let's throw that thing straight behind. So off this straight behind, we get cut off. Let's go straight behind. From here, I want to pivot into our post up. And then let's just get right in that little fade. So in and out, cross, bounce, pull back, and then turn. Yes, yep, so when you turn, we're almost going to like that half spin. So as I pull back, I'm one, two, this side, and then let's just back them in. So I want to keep getting you comfortable of getting, because if we're going to get you more on the perimeter, you're going to get more smalls on you, and we got to get you more comfortable than taking them to the post. Bounce, change, turn. Yep. Yep. Back me down and up. Nice money ball. Good. Yeah. Off that behind now. We'll drive off now. So let's come down. You set me up here with that in and out cross. We drive. Off this behind, you pull back that behind, boom, and I'm over, the, right off that, let's bounce and run. And let's get right to that middle for your little running hook. And now cross, drive, turn, and go. Yeah, nice. You can keep trying to dig to get all the way to the rim. So if I'm late, so if you're here, and you make this change, and you start to dig, and I'm late, Let's just, yeah, let's just run right through me. Because we're thinking you got a mismatch. That's why you're going into the post anyway. So you got me on you, you got somebody skinnier or smaller on you. Let's use our isolation to get into that crab dribble into the post. And then you go. Yeah. If I actually am dictating where you go, you're gonna spin off anyway. Yeah, because if I'm here and I start dictating, yeah, then you're just gonna roll right off. Because I have to dictate with that arm. If I'm dictating with my chest, I'm done. Nice. Shoot two free throws. Yeah, so you see that though? Because all we want you to get to is this position. Because if we can get you here, you have a good enough hook shot to shoot that, and you're smart enough to feel that to spin, and you're big enough to take the hit. So it just, it all just comes down to you make the right decision. If you make the right decision, you get a bucket. If you don't make the right decision, you have to play basketball. And that's, when, that's the only thing we have to drill, is you getting that right decision making. So that's the footwork. That's seeing the situation. That's reps and reps and reps and reps and reps to get you comfortable to know that anytime you get in this, you're gonna make the right play. So just bounce, and then, so you see when you swing that leg through, so go like you're about to run with that left foot, so run with the left, you're about to take off, run, and then swing, you wanna hit me with all of that. So as you get your left foot in front, so just get to here, so get to there, and from here, throw your whole right body into me. Boom, and that's what's gonna clean up your space to spin. Turn to run, and then hit. So I want you to hit. Oh, I, I should feel all of this, so guard me real quick and see what that feels like. So as I go here, boom, and I, see how I'm throwing my hip out? So I'm here, and I'm throwing this into you. That's what's clearing me open to get to that layup. There you go, yeah. And don't be afraid to, to really throw that right foot through. I mean, you're like throwing the right foot all the way in front. So your step, hit, and then you can dribble again if you need to. So as I go here, I can go one, two, and I'm hitting on two. So one, two, there it is. Because we just want to lay hits on them. 
because if we can hit them a lot throughout the game, by the time we get to the end of the game, they don't want to hit with yeah. you anymore. But if we don't hit them, it's, it's, it's nothing. We lose some of your advantage. We want to beat people up throughout the game because you don't know when you hit people. And anytime we got the height advantage, we can shoot fadeaways all day long. Run, turn, and then go. Beautiful. Yes. Yeah. Nice. Grab a drink. Good work. 